Hi boys on a new video. Just uh, playing around here today with a schematic that I found online. Uh, the claim is an 80 meter uh, receiver. I guess we'll soon find out if it is or it isn't. But uh, I came across a uh, an IC today. It's a CSC 2003P and apparently it's a cross reference to uh, also to a TA 2003. So Technically the ship I got should work. So as I sit right now, I have uh, pins 1 through 8, so I have that circuit completed. And uh, 9 and 14, but I still have quite a bit left to add here. All these solid circuitry up here. Still got all this to add. But, uh, it's just something to be at on a Sunday. And uh, right now, this is the circuit as uh, so far. Still working on it. That's the uh, CSC 2003P. Uh, I got a tuning cap out of an old uh, AM FM radio. 455 kilohertz uh, crystal filter as well. All the parts basically is coming out of an old uh, receiver AM FM jobby. And, uh, this be grounds right here. So wouldn't look pretty. I don't really care. <laughs> as long as it works. Um gonna try to make everything as well close as I can. Circuits gotta be uh, all the coils and circuits, everything's gotta be as close as possible. Because of the construction of it. But I guess we'll soon find out how it's going to work, if it's going to work at all. And the little boards, I bought these guys off uh, eBay, PY-5CM. Um, got these boards, I think it was like a five, I think it was like ten for like a dollar, a couple of bucks or something. Pretty expensive, or not expensive, pretty cheap actually. But, uh, yeah. So CSC 2003, 455. Tuning cap. So far, everything's come out of a AM/FM radio. Uh, had to modify the board to accept this. Had to cut it out. I got a bunch of pictures and stuff. What I had to do with it. I had to cut the board out to uh, to accept it. Got to like the old Dremel. Dremel tools make uh, cutting circuit boards easy. <laughs> well, for the most part, anyways. And um, I used a template to mount to get to this. I cut it. I cut a template by using the old circuit board. So I cut it with the old circuit board that the cap was on. And basically, all I did was take it, basically mount it on the board, and get where my holes got to be drilled to, and give her. And that's what I used. I used an old circuit board as a template to uh, to mount that cap. It worked so far, but uh, anyway, I guess we'll see how it goes. But uh, I don't know if it'll work or not, but I guess we'll soon find out. Anyways, if you're interested in seeing how the rest of this project comes out, uh, stay tuned. I'm taking a bunch of pictures as I'm going here. There's probably gonna be more pictures in this video, but anyway, stay tuned.
Business with accounting and payroll administrator or business administration programs. Visit easternacademy.com today to learn more. We're counting down to number one. On the countdown tonight, Zane makes an appearance along with Sia. And uh, this top tenor will be performing at the, uh, the VMAs. Come on. Here's Macklemore catcher the new song, Good Old Days. Number one. So, <clears throat> there you have it. The receiver is working. I'm building as an external audio amplifier. Right now, I'm just using my computer uh, computer speakers. Really touchy.
So the circuit is based off of a uh, an S, uh, a CSC 2003P. And uh, suppose it kind of looked like that. I made a couple little circuit changes around the coils or the inductors. But uh, yeah. Next, my next trick now is to build an audio amplifier to go with it. So I can uh, build it on the probably a little piece of board or something. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Or maybe put it in a little steel case. But uh, an audio amplifier is the next part now to go with this. See how it works. Anyways, here she be. And uh, it works.